followers. Everyone has something to say. Um, but I just want to say that, you know, it's totally fine. For me, it's not about your sexuality per se, but it's about being able to give credit where credit is due. You know, if you are going to be gender bending or gender fluid with your clothing give credit where credit is due you are not the first person to do that you will not be the last person to do that and let's not all worship at the altar of someone that jumps on something so late when trans people queer people of color have been doing something for ever since the beginning of time this is another this goes back to my point about give credit where credit is due that's all i want to say like if you know that someone is doing something and getting loads of praise for it do the research educate yourself because it's a lot a lot more palatable for society to see a white person on the front cover than anyone else but that mm. doesn't mean that that white person hasn't taken a bit from hair and taken a bit from hair i believe harry Sty harry styles stylist called what he was wearing at the grammys English individualism. Does anyone want to explain what English individualism is? It's for me because I just know that this country has taken bits from every other country. So um, I don't know what English individualism. Maybe that's why it looks a hot mess. That's Sorry, let I me just to say on that. Let me just let me just go Google the photos if you want to see. I'm already in all. The, I'm in all the mess. I did not choose. <laughs> you take the violence. It just came out of my pores. <laughs> you chose you chose the path of violence, and I, I respect violence. you for I'm it. I'm so sorry. I, actually, I really resist. respect and, there's, and I think you can totally open up a space to be like, congratulations on your cover, but what are we really talking about? Who, like, if you look at the fans and legions of people worshipping mm. something for, uh, worshipping something in a way that makes it seem as though it's new, yeah. that's what I, that is what I'm having an issue with. Yeah. It's not mm. new. And you are not the first person to do it. Yeah. Um, yeah. And once you reach a certain celebrity status, you are safe from a lot of the hate and the criticism and just, you know, whatever we face on a daily basis. So uh, if you are gender non-conforming or you're non-binary or you're queer, then absolutely take up that space. But if you don't want to talk about those things, then let's not worship the people that are just going on to things and moving moving yeah. in every day. and we should say like i'm here for people doing whatever they want even if they even if that is not discussing sexuality but i would not worship that person yeah i mean i think my issue with this whole thing because like you said before like listen if you are a uh, cisgender straight male bi male whatever if you want to wear a skirt if you want to wear heels if you want to do that then do it 100 percent. but also understand mm. that because by those definitions that you identify as, you you are provided a certain amount of safety that, that queer, non-binary, trans people are not afforded for dressing yeah. that way and have been dressing that way since time. Um, you know, these...